Alright guys, we're back again for yet another Bleach Brave Souls video, and shout out to Aloha because today we are going to be showcasing a Max Transcended Thousand Year Blower Toshiro, so... I don't think we need to talk about this character, I already talked about it in the video prior to... All you guys need to know is that he's easily top 3 best units in the game, currently in the best heart character in the game as of right now, but all you guys need to know is that we have a Max Transcended with 500 SP. Bonus abilities, full stamina SP, and we already have a setup ready to go. Badge, T-Set, Pill, and then uh, triple matrons and links. So, yeah, we're going to cook really hard with this character. How much full stam? Okay, 50. Strong attack damage, 115%. 20% strong attack damage at full stam. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> with us, we are bringing this Hearts and Getsu for, you know, more strong attack damage to Heart Soul Reapers with the Mugetsu link added on top, so it's gonna stack. And then Heart Yuha, because he does boost on the second draw attack, and of course, booster skill, so 43% extra focus added on top of Toshiro. You guys get the point, let's just go ahead and get started, get right into the quest, and see the best damage that you can do. All right, let's go, let's get the SP boost first out. Damn, we're killing way too fast, too fast. We didn't even proc with the ailment chance on bro. Okay, finally we got to proc. Now, let's boost ourselves up with Yuha. Okay, really strong already. 160k. Let's spawn the trap. Yeah. Let's get the SP boost back, even though we're killing too fast. Let's just nuke. There we go. Can we still keep the boost active? Yeah, there you guys go. Uh, yeah. Tell sure it's just broken. I've got nothing else to say, and we are still just getting started with the showcase. <laughs> That's just ridiculous with what this character can do. Uh, yeah, co op content time. It's sad that we can't really use him in guild quests until next week, and that's going to be when ranged no affiliation guild quest is going to be up. So there's that. All right, getting right into epic raids. Uh, here's the setup. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have any of the Toshiro, so we are going to be doing less damage. Just this, but only has paralysis immunity, and we're not going to be making any use of that compared to full stam. So it's better to keep triple Yuha's. Like goddamn, bruh. It's crazy. But the setup is pretty much 100% identical, so you guys don't really need to see much here. Let's just see how fast we can clean this out. Nuke, first things first. Trap. SA3 into the one. SA2. And unfortunately, we cannot clean this out fast, right? Yeah, honestly, not having the Toshir is kind of suck. Because you just. I just lost basically on 60% Berserker. Like, I bet. If we had those triple familiars, oh yeah, bro, we could have easily been able to do a lot faster. But it's still fast nonetheless. So there's that. But now the real kicker is going to be in Inheritance Trials, where we're not bringing familiars. Here we are in Co-op Inheritance Trials. Once again, the setup is exactly the same, identical. There's nothing to really be discussed here. We're just going to dive right on into the quest and clean this up. So let's get started and get right into it. Okay, getting right into it. So let's use the SA1 into the two. Nice. Very nice. We almost cleaned out everyone, but that's cool and all, because guess what? We're just going to move up here, use the EX move. Boom, just like that. Let's line up the SA1. And then SA3. There we go. We got through that fast, although it's going to be a bit slower here because uh, I don't have the same uh, links as my main account, so there's that, but we're still cleaving through this just fast, so it's all right. Boom, there we go, very nice. Now let's just get over here. SA1, that was a clean um, plow through, okay. And we're pretty much done with the quest. All we just have to do is get to the middle, nuke, and it's pretty much game over. How fast did we clean this out? I think we probably have gotten a similar clear time as my main account. If not, slightly better, slightly worse. It was definitely the cooldown lengths um, taking into effect. 49 seconds still. How much did I do with my main account? Let me take a look at my showcase again. I basically cleared by an extra second. So 49 seconds, just slightly better. But at the end of the day, for when it comes to PvE content, if I'm being 100% honest, just having Toshiro 2.5 is going to be enough for what you would want to go for. 
However, in guild quests and of course the likes of Limit Breaker quests, having this guy Max Transcended is going to matter a lot in the long run. And right now we cannot use him in guild quests because it's not even his own rotation yet. So it'll be for when the time comes for the Nightmare Range No Affiliation guild quest. Anywho, aloha, much appreciated, and uh, yeah, thanks again. And if you guys have enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash that like button, share this video with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already, and hit the bell notification so that way you guys are up to date with my most recent videos. This has been your boy, The Death Smasher, and I hope to see you guys all in the next one. So have a wonderful day, lads. Peace out. Bye. Sayonara. Ciao, ciao.